everybody, it is Clock Talk 34. I am positive of this. I'm not backing down. If it's 35, we're still one week behind, and I feel really stupid. Um, you can tell we just got off filming Clock Talk 33 because of our clothing. Uh, but you know, whatever. But, but no one noticed that before, <clears throat> actually. It's because no one commented before. But still. All right, so no one knows. Just, just ignore everything we just said. <laughs> All you need to know is that this episode of Clock Talk is sponsored by Ghost Cloud. Here's this little, like thingy. I, I don't know what to call that. Was that like a title header? Cover. Cover page. Cover, cover yeah. photo. Yeah, cover Here's his cover photo. There's a little logo right here. Uh, he's super awesome. He's from, I believe, the UK. Not positive as of where, but he's a small YouTuber and everything, and he's sponsoring this episode because he's super rad. So, you know, shout out, Ghost Cloud. Uh, so yeah, let's go ahead and get started. Let's go. Throw that out of there. Alright. Hat, first question. Here's the first question. Oh, also, we comment on our lighting again, just because, you know, lighting, we don't know how it looks. We got camera, whoa, well, well, phone over there going that way. Okay. So, right. first question, on so number 34. I'm ready. Say you were offered to a king of a country, would you accept, and which country would you prefer? So, if I was to become the king of a country... Uh, yeah. Would I... Okay. Which country? Okay. Well, I would, of course, accept. I want to be a king of a country. Yeah, okay, I would accept, too. Okay. You know, monarchy all the way. It's working for Britain. Um, I don't know what country, though. I would say... I don't know, you got an idea? I don't know. It's really hard. Because I don't want to... I don't... First off, I don't want to screw up and saying, like, some kind of... Some place and not have it be a country. Because... <laughs> That's very possible. <laughs> but like what though? I don't know. I would say like I don't know. Can can I say anywhere? You can say any any. Okay, fine. Let's do it. You can do anywhere. It doesn't have to be country. Yeah, because I was gonna say like most countries don't even have kings really. Well, I mean, let's just say. All right. Yeah, I know. These are all hypotheticals. Yeah, I know. I was just saying. But... All right. Let's... <laughs> so. Let's think. Okay. Well, you, while you think, I'm going to say probably somewhere in Germany. I'm gonna go Belgium. I don't know if that's a country. It, it is. It is? Yeah, yes. yeah it is, because they do the Olympics on their own. Yeah. Belgium. That's my country. I would want to be the king of Belgium, because they have fantastic chocolates, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, Belgium has fantastic chocolate. Their flag is kind of cool. Actually, it's pretty cool. I like that. You know, I, I like the simple three three ways. Um, I would have to learn German, but I think I could learn German. Especially if I was going to become it, king. Is that the language com kind of compared to English or no? What do you mean? It's kind of close to English and easy to learn. If you know English. I have no clue. Um, sure. <laughs> what, uh, what language is closest to what, English? Apparently, if you know English, you can learn. I don't know French, maybe. No, I think it might be French. That like, if you know English, then I think it might be French because France was like super close with America whenever we were like birthing mm -hmm. ourselves. Yeah. So, <laughs> so maybe like, yeah. Yeah. Okay. So I think maybe French, but still, this is German. All right. So I'd want their chocolate and all that cool stuff. Plus, they have some pretty good science there, too. I'm not a big science guy, but, you know, I could, I could do with some science. Yeah. yeah. All right, so I'm going Belgium. I would say... Well, I don't know, like... I would say Italy, just because. Why? It actually just because why is it, I don't know. I just feel like that's a nice country, and... That's it. Uh, uh, there's not there's many, food, I hear. Yeah, there's not many other... Yeah, like... Oh, yeah. I mean, the Italian-American food is yeah, good, so exactly. I can only imagine what Italian-Italian-American food is. Italian-Italian <laughs> food is! Yeah, so... That's... I just have no thought about... You've, you've never thought of being a king of a country? No, I never thought I know, of... That's a hard thing countries. to be in power. Yeah. <laughs> I see a bit... Alright, other than Belgium, my second pick would be Switzerland, just because also very good chocolate. <laughs> Great bank accounts, apparently, I've heard. And, I mean, Wolf on Wall Street has taught me a lot. Um, and they're a very neutral country, so that's pretty awesome. But, yeah, yeah so what country would you be king or queen of? That's the comments. Yeah, so, next, next question. question. Here you go. Oh, yeah, I got to pick. From the beautiful heart. Ooh, 50 cents! 50, uh, it was 50 cents. <laughs> Alright. Oh, wow. Alright, if you were immortal, what would you wow. do? I think this was a theoretical one. Not long ago on Facebook. So if you were immortal, what would you do? <coughs> Let me clear my throat there. What would you do? Well, if I was immortal, well, I would live forever, clearly. Mm -hmm. Um, what else would I do if I were immortal? I, I'd probably... 
I, I, I have the ability to waste my life at that point, pretty much, right? Yeah, so you can do whatever you want. Yeah, so I mean, I'd probably just do YouTube for forever. I'd make, I'd make a channel that we have the most videos ever uploaded on YouTube. That's insane. I'd do it, if I was immortal. Because, like, I don't have to worry about food or anything. Yeah. I'd also, I'd, I'd probably... What about money, though? That's the problem I'm thinking of. Um, I mean, if I was immortal, I'd keep things. Like, from long ago. Oh, yeah. And then like... save them and then sell them. Yeah. Because, like, it'd be super old and be like, oh, man, how'd you get hold of this? And it's like, well, it was my father's 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 mother's. But it was actually mine. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I wouldn't say that, but... Yeah, I know. I, I think what I would do is travel everywhere to, like, each country to see how it is. That'd probably, yeah, that'd be nice. Because, I mean, you're, you know, you gotta find somewhere nice to live. Yeah, right. Yeah, I mean, actually... You I would just, it would just be fun, too. So. Yeah, you can yeah. pretty much live anywhere, too. Yeah. Because, like, Australia apparently everyone wants to kill you, but... Who cares if you're immortal and those spiders and kangaroos and stuff can't kill you? Yeah, right. you kangaroos are real. So you can do anything, like, you can't be scared of nothing. Yeah! You're immortal! Yeah. Now, okay, now the problem, though, is you are immortal, but... What type of immortality are we talking here? Are we talking, like, Deadpool immortality, or, like, just regular immortality? Like, Highlander? Just regular. Okay, alright. I'd still do everything, but you still do kind of have to be kind of scared. Because... You can't go and get your limb chopped off because it's not gonna uh, come back. Yeah, but but I, I guess you can live. Whatever. You're gonna live long enough until they can like make synthetic ones, I guess. Yeah, but, but don't don't bank on that. Yeah, because <laughs> I kind of like having both hands. It, it, <laughs> Just say it, it's like it's like getting my legs chopped off, and it's like oh, in like five years they'll figure out something, but then they yeah, don't. but no, they don't. And then you'd like have two prosthetics, and, it, and, and then you, you just... wish, and then you wish you were dead. Yeah, that would. Oh yeah, like Johnny got his gun. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. I would hate that. Cause like half your face is just like your your potato. Yeah, literally. And at that point, it's just like, well, damn. And then you can't die. So what do you do? <laughs> I have no idea. So so would you would you even be Im immor Im You Im would be immortal, but is it worth it at that point? Yeah, is it worth There's it? a certain point where you don't want to be immortal anymore. I, I think you just gotta be careful. Oh, but okay. So you're retracting your previous statement. Yeah. Okay. So be careful while being immortal. Yeah. There should be like posters for that. Just that sounds like a pretty good slogan. Be careful while being immortal. Yeah. Pretty good slogan, I'd say. Yeah. yeah. Oh, what else you can do? You buy how you make money? Buy life insurance. Yeah. Yeah. That'd be awesome. And then you could like you could fake your own death and collect the life insurance, and then boom. Okay, I guess. That's <laughs> good. I know you could, but that's pretty random. How? How? Can I get a job? Yeah. <laughs> what? That's stupid! Dude, you can- I know. <laughs> but if you get a job, you can, like, upgrade to, like, every single single job ever. You could do every single job ever, but... I, I don't know if I want to. I guess that could be it. If I were to do that whole wasting the life on YouTube thing, I could, uh, do that. Yeah. <laughs> Just See, that would be do fun. a series yeah. of every job ever. Yeah, that would be fun. Like making YouTube videos for forever, yeah. having the most videos ever. Yeah, yeah, that would be pretty rad. And then we all, then we would still only have 100 subscribers. <laughs> so, so would you live immortal? Or yes. Not? Would you go immortal? What kind of immortality would you go? Like Deadpool, Wolverine, or Highlander? If you don't know what Highlander is, go check out that movie. Super rad movie. Also, if you don't know what Deadpool or Wolverine is, where have you been? It's been all over the interwebs and stuff. And clearly, you're on them. So just go and search bar right there. So, thank you everybody for watching. Remember, this episode of Clock Talk was sponsored by. Whoop! My own sound effects right there. Ghost Cloud, guys with a zero, no Zeke, no O's. Uh, go check him out. He's, you know, he's super rad. He got some great alien isolation videos currently. And Billy's dancing our way out. Thanks for watching that video. And if you like it, uh, comment, subscribe, and like below. See you again soon. Oh, what? No! You just shut Oh, at least we finished. Oh, the card's full. Let's see how much we actually got wow. on that. Dude, how much space do you have on that? I have enough. Wait. Why is it full, though? Well, it just turned off, so I mean... It's not like we missed anything big, I don't think. I know, but like... Oh, still. How do I delete it? I deleted most everything, though. Yeah, go to stop that one too. <laughs>